Hi, I'm Simon with AppliancePartsPros.com. Today we're going to show you how to repair your appliance. Are you ready? Remember, anytime you work on your appliance, make sure it's unplugged or the circuit breakers are off so there is no chance of electrocution. In this video, we'll show you how to replace the grease filter in a Whirlpool microwave. It's going to be an extremely easy repair. should only take a couple of minutes to show you how to do it. When you open up the package, you're going to get a new grease filter. The grease filter filters the air from above the cooktop whenever the exhaust fan is turned on. It's washable, but after years of use, sometimes the best thing is just replacing it. The grease filter is located underneath of the microwave. In our case, it's on the table, but most likely your microwave is installed over the cooktop. So, I'll open the door and remove the cooking tray and the turntable support ring. After that, I'll place the microwave on its back. Slide the old grease filter to the left for just a quarter of an inch and pull the right end out. This is the old grease filter next to the new one. If you don't have this part, you can get it from AppliancePartsPros.com. Slide the new grease filter in and pull it right to lock in. Place the microwave upright. Place the turntable support ring in the microwave so the wheels will fit in the groove. Install the cooking tray on a coupler in the center and on the turntable support. Turn it slowly to make sure it's on properly. Close the microwave door, turn the power on, and go back to cooking. Thank you for being a part of another successful repair brought to you by AppliancePartsPros.com. For any of your future appliance repair projects, please Check out our other repair videos available on our site, on Facebook, and on YouTube.